Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My honorable teachers and my respected audience, I would like to welcome all of you here with Islamic greetings. Assalamu alaikum. Now it's time to introduce myself. My name is Meher Farah. I have done BSc and nowadays I'm a student of ELC. As we know that the purpose of today's gathering, the purpose of today's gathering, we are going to talk about a topic which is given by our respective teachers. Are we spending a healthy life? Well, I have dispensed my presentation into three portions. In my first portion, I will tell you the definition of health. And in my second portion, I will tell you are we spending healthy life or not? If we are not spending healthy life, then which problems have encountered to spend a healthy life? And in my third portion, I conclude my presentation and I give you only one suggestion and I'm sure with the help of that suggestion you can spend a healthy life. So let's start with the definition of health. Before we define health, we should know that the definition of health is not same person to person. So we had better define health in that way where everyone agrees. The health is just like a crown which is only seen by a patient. And the definition of health is the balance or equilibrium that Allah has given in our body and soul. And we should maintain that balance or equilibrium. I am going to translate into Urdu as well. Allah ki zat ne hamare jism aur ruh mein jo tawazun paida farmaya hai wo apne asal se nahat ne paaya. That is called health. Here one more question arises. What is the relation of soul in a topic of healthy life? And the answer is so simple. Because human beings are a combination of two things. Number one, body. And number second is soul. If we neglect one part, like your body, or if we neglect soul, then how can we complete our discussion about a human being? The base, the soul is playing a role of a base of a building. And the building is our body. If our base is weak, then how can you say that your building is stronger? If your base is strong, then you can say that your building is stronger. When, you f when your soul is full of... When our soul is full of diseases, then how can you say that your body is healthy? When your soul is healthy, then you can say that your body is healthy. But in our society, but in our society, mostly people think that health is only related to our body. But we are unsuccessful in this field as well. Because everyone in this society is spoiling the health of others just to maintain their health. For example, shopkeepers are selling expiry things just to maintain their health. They are spoiling others' health. Vegetable sellers are selling stale vegetables just to maintain their health. They are spoiling others' health. Everyone, is, everyone in this society is busy in cutting up the throats of others. When everyone has a thinking like that, when everyone has a mind like that, then it's a death of a healthy society. We see human beings in, you know, markets and, you know, in buildings, but there is no humanity. But there is no humanity. We look alive, but actually we are not. We are dead. I'm extremely sorry. The topic is becoming a bit serious here. <laughs> As we know that health is only related to our body. But my dear fellows and respected teachers, I am going to disappoint you in this field as well. Because everything which builds our health, actually these things are spoiling our health. Just like water, it's a basic tree of our health. It also mixed with some chemicals that you know my studies. Here I remember that once an old man was saying that when you grow your fruits, your vegetables, your rice with you know some sprays and artificial feeds, then there is no difference in broiler chicken and these things. And these things are the basic thing. Anyone wants to eat broiler chicken at your home? No 
chicken at your home. But actually we are eating breaded chicken. Alas, the topic is moving back where I have started. The building of our health is full of cracks. And our society is just becoming a patient who is shivering and who is crying due to pain. It's high time we pondered about ourselves. Now I will conclude my presentation and I will give you only one suggestion that I promised you at the start of my presentation. And I'm 100% sure that you can spend healthy life with that suggestion. It's high time we make the relation of our soul with Allah Almighty. Then you can spend a healthy life. Because when your base is strong, your building is obviously strong. And that's it. If you have any question, please do feel free to ask me a question. So, as Salasif said that, we have a parameter, you know, and we should uh, try to help from this. Many people are well educated, but they, do, but they are smoking. They don't offer prayer. What do you think about that person? Allah will go ahead and say. You have said that we can spend our life by making a relation of soul with Allah. But all English people, they, have, they don't have this relation, but they are spending a healthy life. How can you say that? No one in this world knows about the other, you know, heart. How can you say that they are spending a healthy life? It's extremely apparent nowadays. We know that they are not actually following the teachings of Islam. We understand. Actually, uh, in the Hadith, which is a form, every thing, 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 every And they are, uh, they are fulfilling the rights of their bodies. That's why they are, uh, you know, spending a healthy life. So what about the mental satisfaction? What? In the in form of, they are, they are mentally satisfied or not? Because uh, point of view, they have no, they are, there is no qualm and there is uh, no, you know, the prayers and the worship. So, so do you think they are spending the, 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 the healthy mental satisfaction? How can I say that they are mentally satisfied? Alright, another question. What do, you, what do you think about those people who go on a diet? Who go? On a diet. Diet? Yes, they are taking. You should go on a diet. Yeah. Really? Yeah, so we can. We should go. We should go for that. So many slim people in the market. So many slim people. Like, like, like. Like me. 